guys, this is Heidi with Kiddos Corral, and today we're doing my prep video um, that I promised you guys that we would do every, um, well, once a month for Sunday Simple Supper. I got my husband over here. He's washing his hands. We have dyed our hands blue from blueberries. No, you have. I have. He has not. See my fingers? Anyways, what we have already done is we have done spinach, blueberries, and... Um, bananas in these freezer bags and these are going to be for our green shakes and I've got those all made up and now and then in this bag we have extra bananas that we're going to freeze individually where you guys, this month I am going to do a lot of crock pot meals and so I have my freezer bags ready and I'm gonna go ahead and get a sharpie and start labeling those I've got my recipes I wrote them down last night so they would be easy to put together and just one by one now if you see something that you would like me to do a Sunday simple supper recipe on that I'm putting together on my crock pot meals um, I know there's a boogles boogles and boogles and boogles of <laughs> crock pot meals online but if you would happen to see something um, I would be glad to put it in my grocery um, buys for next month and I will shoot it for you okay. so for my prep I got all of my um, shake stuff already in the baggies and frozen. I've got two crock pot meals. This is the balsamic chicken drumsticks. Those are freezing. And yes, my kitchen is a disaster. Just got home from the grocery store and I'm just trying to put this all together. <laughs> So now this is the world's best chicken. It has to be cooked on low for eight hours and I'm following the directions I have written down. And basically what I'm doing, I need to get my tripod, but what I'm doing is I'm using this bag to hold this bag, which is my Ziploc bag. And that way um, it doesn't go everywhere. And I go ahead and I measure out my meat and then I'm mixing up my sauces in here and pouring it into the bags as the directions. This is the second day of my food prep. Um, I did all my freezer meals last night, and I'll show them to you in a little bit. But right now, um, I just boiled a chicken in thyme and garlic like I always do, and I gotta wait for it to cool. I knew it was gonna take the longest, so I'm out of breath, guys. I knew it was going to take the longest, and so I went ahead and um, I got the chicken done while I was doing some other things. I have been cleaning house, so this isn't like, good morning guys, this is more like 4 o'clock in the late afternoon. So this I have boiled for um, two pans, two pans of chicken enchiladas, and now I'm going to get started on putting together my 
to lasagnas um, so I better get started because I got a lot of work to do and I have a new meal that is in my crock pot for dinner tonight so I'm excited about that I do have my first crock pot meal in there and it is the sweet and sour chicken it smells really really good and I do have to make rice to go with it but that don't take no time at all oh my goodness I don't take no time so I am just going to go ahead and start on my lasagna My second pan of chicken enchiladas there is my chicken enchiladas thank you son and on top I'm just using this masking tape to label the tops of the foil so that is what I'm doing right now I gotta get these rolled up okay guys I am done again because I ran out of pans and you can't freeze murals if you don't have pans to freeze them in so I do have all of these crock pot murals right here um, which I'm really excited about um, then I have one and then two three four uh, pans which I don't know if you guys can tell there's one right there one with a green lid and then one right there and then one right there so it's four it's two lasagnas and two chicken enchiladas down there in the bottom I gotta quickly go because my thing's saying it's gonna die on me um, I have uh, 30 green shakes already in a pack uh, made up and yeah that is it for this month um, what I'm really really happy because I have a total of 14 14 meals already pre-made in the freezer now that doesn't include sides so like a lot of things will require me to make a rice or make a baked potato or make some green beans or something with it you know but honestly if you can get the main dish done and most of it goes in your crock pot I'm all for trying it and trying the new recipes and specific that you would like to see in the prep video please let me know and I'd be glad to do it um, I don't get much feedback on you guys as far as um, not all the time anyways of like specifics on what you would like to see so um, please let me know what you'd like to see on my prep videos um, I will tell you making 14 meals in two days lot of dishes guys and a lot of garbage because it's like a lot of boxes and you know stuff that you cook that I will say and I you know give you guys a heads up if you guys are interested in doing it um, I want to give you guys an honest um, approach to it um, that is my trash can right there I have to get that out um, just to show I just loaded the dishwasher and I still have these dishes and I just hand washed all of those dishes so 
just a little bit of uh, some reality there on when you make 14 meals it dirties up a lot of stuff so I'm gonna talk to you guys later I hope you guys enjoyed this prep video um, give me a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed subscribe to kiddos I would love to have you on board and see what I'm doing every week and I'll be talking to you guys again soon bye